Do you need a perfect traveling bag? And does it have to be both cute and effective? Let me stop myself there before it starts to sound like an infomercial. What I'm trying to say is that I have a bag right here that might be close to perfection for the traveling base out there. Now there's a reason to why I say close to perfection. So the negatives on this bag would be in the end of this video, but first, Let's focus on the positives. The bag that we're reviewing today is called the Convertible Mini Weekender Bag and it's from BASE. BASE, if I'm not mistaken, is made by the actress Shay Mitchell. It costs about 140, how much is it? $148, something around there. While editing this video, I actually noticed that I said the wrong price to you guys because it was a little bit confusing. If you live in Europe, it actually costs 136 euros, but if you live in the US, it's cheaper. So it costs $118. So it's not the most cheapest bag that you can find out there, and it's not the most expensive. It's just somewhere in the middle. The reason to why I was looking for a traveling bag that is effective and cute at the same time was because my job actually requires for me to travel. So I have taken this baby with me and she has been used basically because I'm not even home right now. But let's get into the positives of this bag. So there was two very important things that I was looking for and that was having a trolley sleeve and having a detachable bottom compartment. And this has both of that which means that I can detach the bottom compartment of this bag and it also comes with a trolley sleeve in the back here and if you're not gonna put it on your trolley you can just close it up and it will become a pocket. The third thing that I think is very important is the interior pockets okay we need the different pockets we just don't tear our bag up when we're looking for one item so this bag actually comes with more than four interior pockets and in those pockets you can also find vegan leather detachable laptop case now this case they say that is padded but it's not padded enough for me to feel my laptop is safe there but i'll put papers in there and i would also put an ipod there if i was traveling with one and there's also a key holder which makes it very easy <laughs> to travel with there's a lot of positives when it comes to this bag i'm not gonna lie because i didn't find lots of bags that had everything that I needed, like the trolley sleeve, the pockets on the inside, and the detachable bottom part where you can put shoes and whatever you need in there. But there is some negatives. The first thing I noticed when I unboxed this bag was the size of it. Now this one is supposed to be the mini one, but it's quite big. <laughs> it's huge. The reason to why I wanted the detachable bottom part was that so I can have the bag and just wear it like as a normal everyday bag and not like a travel bag but that's not the case here this is the bag is still very big without the bottom compartment if you're traveling like flying i don't think this bag will count as a personal item i think it would actually count as a luggage i'm thinking like the flight attendants would actually ask you to put it in the over compartment in in the plane that's because of the size it's just huge and I just really wanted it to be mini but that's not the case in this situation and the second thing that I didn't like as well was the quality of the bag now for a bag that's costing around $165 I expected a little bit of a better quality especially when it comes to the touch I'm very sensitive when it comes to touch it's very rough and it makes sound like when you're <laughs> when you're trying to open it and everything if I just do this like it's very it's very rough material i guess that's good like when it comes to being water resistant and everything but um it just doesn't feel good in the hands and as you can see i got the brown one which makes it more visible when it comes to the wrinkles so if you are actually gonna get this bag i would recommend to get a black one then because it would just show less they say the material is made at a beauty canvas i'll put the list here and the lining inside is poly and the lining inside is also not the softest. To end this review in a good note, I do want to mention that you can get 15% off in their website on any item if you're a new member there. So that's a plus. Yeah, that's my opinion on this bag. Let me know in the comment section down below if you guys actually think it's worth the price for this bag. That's about it. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.